Hi, this is Maji Noni, and here's my review for Warlord of Mars. Now, as you can see, Black Adam approves of this cover. So let me push him aside for now, and let's get on with the review. Now, after the review, I'll uh, go through the page by page so people can see it more. So if you want, you're worried about spoilers, it'll, that, that stuff will happen later on. Uh, anyways, this is a number one put out by Dynamite. And... I thought I'd get this review out of the way because in case this is something that you're interested in, at least you can probably still find it on the shelves. Now, I'm really, I, I'm actually still trying on the fence with this book. Uh, parts of me enjoyed it. Another part of me was like, I just need a little bit more about what's going on. And what basically what it takes place is, um, it takes place sometime after the Civil War. And you have basically a group of people out in the West, um, Arizona to be exact. And you know you have the you know soldiers who now are basically going around going, I don't know what to do with my time. So what they do is they go around and you know hunt Indians, obviously. And then you know they're kind of cocky and jerkish. Well, anyways, they go into a tavern and they meet some people. They push their buttons purposely, and well, they get. In trouble because of that. This guy here is his name is John Carter, which would be you know John Carter, warlord, warlord of Mars, and he doesn't take kindly to what they have to say, and uh, him and his buddy basically attack the soldiers and kill them. Now um, from there they basically just go off into the sunset, and you know it's like what's going to go on with them? Where's the people from Mars? Well. That's the other thing. Now, the other part of this issue is what's going on on this strange, mysterious planet. And you have these aliens, and then there's a little battle between the two different races. It looks like they're saving some kid, a young brew-type people and, and that are trapped and about ready to become food. Now, the story... See, this is where I'm kind of torn with the story. It's, a, it's an introduction. It throws you right into the middle of things. And on one hand here, and at the beginning part, you get a true beginning, meaning here's some characters, you know they're going to go to Mars, but they're not there yet. So they're, you know, it's basically building everything up. And it's like a weird, that's why I'm kind of really torn with this. On one hand, it, it's, it's given me, it's got my interest, but on the other hand, I'm like, uh, these aliens really look kind of crappy looking. They don't really look cool, you know. It, it looks kind of generic looking. So I'm kind of that's a lot of part of me where I'm torn. I do plan on getting the second issue though, and I think that it, if you're looking for maybe like a sci-fi-ish book, this might be worth it. Um, in that it's a little bit, it's going to be a little bit different than your typical sci-fi books. You know, it's not going to be like like Battlestar Galactica or uh, Farscape or anything like that, you know, it's, you know, these are established characters and, um, you know, it's basically off of that mythos. So I'm really curious to see where this is going to go. I mean, honestly, I haven't even read John Carter, uh, Warlord of Mars, so I really don't know. I remember seeing comic books a long time ago with him, but that was about it. I never really bothered to read it, but I thought this book was actually on sale. So, I got it very cheap. So I figured, you know, what the heck, I'll buy it. Um, that's my review, I guess you can say. It's it's right in the middle, where I think it can teeter good and it can teeter bad. I'm not quite sure yet. But it might be worth giving a try, because it didn't make me want to just vomit. Or poke my eyes out. Or anything like that. Anyways... Uh, if you have any comments or questions, let me know. Uh, subscribe to the channel. Uh, rate the video up or down. Let me know what you think. And um, for those people who uh, want to see the whole book before they buy it, um, I'll leaf through the pages. Uh, otherwise, if you don't want spoilers, then you can stop now. Even though I kind of gave a little bit too much, but I had to give you guys a foundation of what's going on. So anyways, as I mentioned, there's the... Uh, the exchange of words, the Union soldiers aren't too um, happy, I mean, they're not too nice, 
Uh, some gunplay. Carter shoots them. Bartender's like, don't worry about it. And um, they go off riding in the moonlight. Space. Battle. These are very warlike, I guess you can say, these beings here. They're like, um, they're, they don't treat coward cowardly actions kindly, I guess you could say. And by that I mean it's, uh, they're, the woman basically try to run, and they're like, well, she's an adult, she should have known better. And yeah, there's a woman alien somewhere here. Who was the, there she is. She was gonna get eaten by this thing. And there you go. Um, if you guys get it, if you get it, let me know what you think. I'm really curious to know. Um, so, until next time.